Finally, yes. Finally, finally. Finally! So of course I'm back with another really quick Pokemon Go video. So of course I actually didn't want to break it down to another video, which I completely unnerly forgot about though. Of course we have the season of heritage. I said um I said um heritage. I, I forgot what I said in my other video. Um my, I didn't say heritage, I said um Hamash or something like that. I don't know why I said it like that though. Just, but yeah, we got a new info for the next of course season. It basically replaces the season mischief. Of course we got a lot of new events, a lot of new stuff for Uncle Bill. Stuff like that. I didn't make a whole video breaking down all this stuff though, but I did want to probably make this a video because there's so much stuff I want to talk about and go over and stuff like that. Of course there's some good hey get it started now. Again, this video shouldn't be too too long though. Of course it's with the Epic Con for the season of Heritage. Uh, we got a lot of just good stuff here. We have a Swine Ups and Zen Day. We have um let me can I do a little bit too much stuff. Um there's a lot of good stuff actually. December actually seems really good though. Like it's crazy. You see November and then you see December. It's like holy crap. Um, but yeah. Oh, uh, we have uh, you know, of course, um, the book of um, uh, season, uh, you know, the whole season, everything right here. It's 10 a.m. local time, summer first to March first. You know, like it's like literally replacing the season of mischief. So on inset day, of course, we have also just we have the welcome to the season. Uh, we have, of course, free exit for December again. This is a, a monthly stuff. Also, we are getting the Joshua Tour event though. So again, last year we had the Kento event. This year we have the Joshua event. Um, I think you had to pay purchase tickets and stuff like that. Like the Kento event, or I think it's free for everybody. I can't. I think that was Kento for everybody. I think I know we had a Kento based event though i might have been mad but i had them but yeah i said purchase so you'll probably have to be purchase it until like july the 10th then of course february will be johto more jo part two johto i think i think kento was part one it had two parts to it this is free monthly bonus right here for time to start this for um each every day like all the days until i have of course um it tends to start this for the first catch of each day okay so kind of cool so ever um so it returns like 12 p.m the 12 a.m local time you'll um, be able to get it so it's Pretty cool. Again, um, for this one, I think completely fit for everybody. These are all like they're all different goals you have to meet. So the time it starts is you're gonna get at the end of it. I mean, you had to get basically the goal is how much you had to get. And these are all like milestones at like 500, 1,000, 3,000. I've actually done all these already. Almost all these already. Done. This is completely free for everybody. We have a Dano hat right here. We have the Gumi hat. We have a hat from the um, last one for February. So on um, number we'll have again. This is the goal again. You had to cut some uh, starters. Like you had to get 500, 1,000. Those are actually really good rewards. Again, you get a free ride horn. You get like a sandal for the community days. I think we're going from Electric Community, all Electric Community Pokemon will have all the moves like Riot Horns or Brock Rector. So you want to get a good one, you have like going to get a Hundo or like, you know, Max Tech, Max, max HP, and you know, whatever, vice versa. Um, it's going to be really good there. I'm going to get really good, some really good rewards and stuff like that. Get some Pine Maps, XP, a Dino, and you know, also a Dino. You can also get one from the Research as well, though. That's a double that's a double killer right there. That's really good. Uh, the Junto one will have, and the Portrait will have times of catchy XP, so. All experience you get, like if you get 1,000, 6,000, and stuff like that, of course, all the XP catch basically. Um, so the goal, sorry, we will. So, um, the goal right there, that's our main goal. You have to reach stuff like that. Again, that's how much experience you're basically going to get as you go on again. Let's say when you get 1,000, you'll get um, when you get 6,000 up again. Like I said, it's a really big milestone though for the best for catch experience. I mean, you gotta pretty much catch almost every Pokemon all day though. But for example, like for like community day, like that, they should like I said, all the community Pokemon coming back in the wild. Now, I highly, highly recommend doing that though. And this one's, I think, just for catching. I think, like, for instance, like for walking and stuff like that, for hiking, because about that though. So, um, I think I didn't just catch a Pokemon in general though, so for everybody, I think that's how it is though. Again, we'll get more information when that comes out. I'll probably do a short on it or whatever though. So, again, like I said, the first one's free. This is how the story. I thought it was like for all the team, basically, you know, like we get like all these things, but it's just so they're just there for like the promotional thing. So, yeah, again, like I said, uh, we had to get like 1,000 Stardust, 5,000 Stardust, and this is the end goal we're going to get. And that, of course, we basically the goal how much we, we you know, not everybody in the world, but we individually for missions, you actually had to um, get like, you know, you actually had to, you know, catch Pokemon, get Stardust, and yeah, you guys collect, uh, collect it as much as you can. And you can put loads of Stardust from like tons of Stardust. It'd be, it'd be cool if we had like all the, um, um, what do all the, the, um, like one of the, um, Twilight Hours. That'd be kind of cool. Actually, a little bit cheating, a little bit too, though. So, yeah, pretend to start us to be back here a little bit, though. But yeah, the free Stardust and stuff like that. Not really free, but actually, the Stardust is not, I mean, again, like I said, you just gotta catch Pokemon or just, you know, basically catch Pokemon, get Stardust, um, go, you know, away to the last one again, let's say, get the rewards that Dino had. Uh, I think you get like two of them. I think it might be a glitch or whatever though, because I'm trying to you guys can get two of them. Uh, this is the all the new encounters and stuff like that for this season. A lot of crazy encounters too. Like there's so many encounters. The eggs have been changed up. We have like smaller little eggs. I think they're already live in like a week. Um, like the Dene, Alter, uh, like these are like the regular gum 10k eggs. I think they're just smaller little eggs. Those you can get like all those Pokemon here. It seems like, you know, Pokemon here. 
I think it's the same one though, I think it's just like the same eggs, just that uh, they're smaller, so what that. And it's affecting, it's affecting this fast thing. You guys get a lot of good Pokemon just from like the wild and stuff like that though. So this is more the north, this is the northern hemisphere of Pokemon. Um, this is where I live, so northern hemisphere, right, even the US and stuff like that. And we took all the Sinnoh starters, Daily Bird, Cottony, Vanilla, like, um, which are dealing. And for the southern hemisphere, it'll be Tangela. Um, you'll definitely tell by the spawns because you can do like, you've got Sinnoh starters, like I know the Kento starters too. But yeah, again, like I said, cities. Forests, mountains, by water, like the ocean, stuff like that, of course. And if you're in any of those areas, it seems like the, all the Pokemon will be different and change in appearance and stuff like that. Not really change in appearance, but appearing differently in different areas. So that's a really cool gimmick, though, because in Pokemon Go, they really don't really specify that. It'd be cool if this was permanent, though, just because you don't get varieties of different Pokemon. Because I got in, like the whole Aeron, you know, Aeron family uh, in the wild. So I got rid of Grotto earlier. I got built on like, all the Kindle starters. It was insane. Like, it was utterly insane. Like, December is insane right now, though. So, yeah. Uh, we have. Um, like I said, um, my mouse, okay, it might be my mouse actually, give me a second. Yeah, it's okay. Uh, my mouse is just freaking, sometimes it does, I just mess this up. So yeah, uh, these are all the community of Pokemon, so basically every Pokemon, like I said, this year will be coming back this year. Um, and then for all the Pokemon from last year, I have, all have their moves, but they'll all be in, like, raids and 2K eggs. So as I said, you get instant effectiveness by standing still, which is, which they did before in the game, they took it out for some odd reason. The season of shift made sense and stuff like that, of course, if they had to walk around. But the person that tested it out, I guess, to get, like, people feedback, because a lot of people did not like it. The feedback and stuff like that was really not bad, but no, nobody in the moment did not because Okay, this sort of Um, but yeah, um, yeah. Uh, re re remote raid passes were doing pretty damage, of course, for Pokemon and raids remotely, which I think before it did do that much damage, but now it's going to do that. Good to get some while and, um, just playing Pokestop, stuff again, those, those are really helpful, you know, send gifts to friends and stuff like that. Again, one extra candy, of course, from trading, and also you get tons of, you get guaranteed extra candy when trading Pokemon. It doesn't matter if you do, like, 100 trades a day, you get, like, 100 extra candy for our Pokemon and stuff like that, of course. Um, so it's really good, again, I say, this, uh, I'm assuming this will be the Kinto and Jota Jor, um, like I said, for writer and stuff like that, though, so. Yeah, that's one fold during the season of Heritage. It says pre purchase though, but I don't know if it's gonna be free for everybody. It might be, I don't know, because I think a lot of people didn't go to the Kinto event last year. Um, but yeah, again, with COVID being a little lightly, again, like I said, I know we have vaccines and stuff like that. Again, last year, 2020, it did hit us a little bit hard in the US, really, really, in, in just in the world in general. It really was bad, but also in general, though, like I said, um, <laughs> also in general, um, I feel like it's a little bit better ish this year. Again, we had a whole couple cases though, but nothing like crazy, crazy going on. But that's not what happens on instant day. Again, I'm in cold strong. This I said, Pokemon Grunt and Pokemon will be spawning a little bit more often during these times and stuff like that though. So, uh, that one's really good. Uh, what was this one right here? I think this, the, the Call of Community Pokemon is all talking about though. So, for example, if you get like a, um, these all Pokemon, again, like I said, um, these all Pokemon though from last year, they'll be all in 2k eggs and, um, um, the, 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 the one star rates, um, also, again, like I said, your walking distance is going to be half though, so you'll probably die, like, well, walk like, what, 0 0.5 kilometers, give me an egg. They'll, they'll probably be um, against, like, like, basically for, like, what, 7? Like, in the 7th, no, it'd be cool, it'd be great. But yeah, I vote, like, in the 17th and 19th, but actually, um, with, I think, yeah, 11 a.m. Um, 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. local time. So, like I said, whatever time zone you're in, like, whatever time it is, like, for me right now, it's 7.16, boom, there you go. But yeah, like I said, it would get the roof for a Yes, it is. Um, for example, you have a pimple up of stuff, we have a pimple up right here, um, like, you know, see if you say for, like, maybe, like, this year, I always have a couple good pimple ups. Um, you get Hydro Cannon, uh, right here, Rock, 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 rock Record, Abra of a Counter, um, see that with bullets and stuff like that, really good, actually, Superior of a Frenzy Plane and stuff like that, like I said, if you have any of these Pokemon team, stuff like that, even with 5,000 community moves, I think, like, Vaporeon has Skulled, um, um, but yeah, Vaporeon has Skulled, Jolteon has Zap Cannon, Flareon has Super Power, um, Espeon has Shadow Ball, I know, um, Umbreon has Psychic, um, Bullet Seed I think is for Leafeon, Blaceon has Water Pulse, and so Beyond has Fly Shock. It actually is decent on it, I mean, it's charming, you know, charming, um, char yeah, charming, yeah, then goes back to the thing. I show Hydro Cannon, um, just call it Shadow Ball, um, and it's just things with, um, Psychic, like, again, like I said, you all, like I said, all these pretty won't be raids and one star raids, again, it's random and stuff like that, and eggs, so if you want to get them, get their exclusive moves and stuff like that, they'll make sure they're all going to then, my shop, again, a lot of people can go after my shop, Rose Raid, uh, yeah, a lot of people are actually going to be after my shop, it's cool to me, though, because the XL candy gets really worth it, because they're in the shadow form, and stuff like that, though, so yeah, this is all the summer survivor, pretty much already went over in my past videos, um, uh, I know we have the Dragon Flower Tower event basically basing off of the Dragon Flower Tower from the Horse Unifa. Dragon right here will be in the game for the first time. A lot of people are speculating that. I love myself though, it has a really sick shiny. I like to like shiny. Well, in general, it's kind of just cool though. But yeah, also with the season of Heritage, a lot of people are thinking all these Pokemon can come as well. These are all the new, um, um, yeah. 
Pokemon from the new game on um, Arceus um, Legends. Basically, a lot of uh, it's early, basically early, it's based off the base paths of early Sinnoh. I don't know. I just got a lot of Sinnoh love this year. So yeah, it's based off the paths of Jeff Sinnoh. So a lot of Pokemon I've got changed overhaul. Like Zoroark, um, and of course Zor um, Zoroark, and of course Zoroark right here. Actually, it looks really good. I like, I like it. The ghost, it's ghost and normal. I think Stamper, I think it's like you can, I think it's like you can normal now. Oh, it's like getting rocked, I can't remember. Very, very, I think it's, I know, Psych, Psych, and Vine. A lot of people are expecting more of these Pokemon and Gum. Rylop has Rock and Fire. Um, Psych is like a right here. I think it's Rock and... It might be just Rock, I can't remember. I know instead of evolving into Psych, they're evolving into this. Um, what's it? Kelvor? 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 I can't remember. And of course, Vasculin's up. Again, a lot of people are expecting... Uh, actually, they can just make sure they just evolve it though. Because again, it's based off like the whole, you know, like a little, like, like oh, they evolve during the Fireman thing. If Tom's like... I know like Gallier, like Gallier, Mar I like Zoroark has like, I think it's backstory, it's like, you know, it got shot by humans, so I ran away in the mountains, so basically it died, I'm not joking, it literally freaking died. It went in the mountains and died, and it came in the space, came back, like those, so it was close to normal. But it's gonna be nothing for fighting type moves, so, yeah. So yeah, um, again, that's pretty much everything I want to kind of cover and go over though today, like I said. Oh, uh, what was this? I think this is all the stuff I already went over. You know, all the raids are currently going on right now, um, want to add that in the video, restrams.com. Um, I'm gonna link everything below for you guys. But again, it'll be really easy to find everything. Um, the yeah, new XL talking about, all the new little updates, XL candy, and stuff like that. The Pokestop step update, which again, we just made a stop. And other people interact with it and go to level 3 and get basic bonus rewards and stuff like that. They'll bring it. I did everything, like I said, pretty much a counter from over and so video. New, um, um, homage on my way from. Heritage um, background, stuff like that. Of course, I also new wallpaper right here. So it seems like um, this is, I think, like what? Bird Bite? Um, this is um, Carlos Pokemon from Gen 6, I believe. Yeah, I can't tell you what to do with the whole Yeah, the Gen 6 Pokemon. A lot of people are speculating that can come because we are doing a, um, a costume. A costume. Um, I see, yeah, custom Pokemon, costume themed um, Christmas Pokemon, and of course, I said Pokemon. I'll probably explain more in the, um, the part 2 again right here for um, Halloween. Halloween, um, or Christmas. Uh, right here. Right here. I can't remember which tab it was. I got so many tabs open. Right here. So yeah, it'll be a couple of days events from 16th to the 31st. So yeah, yeah, again, like I said, you got a long week to do that though. So it seems like Bark Bite is coming to the game. Again, they always see it like Ho Hoopa. They had like Fur Fruit. They had um, the um, costume, um, of course, week. Past week, uh, we had Hoopa in the window and some of that. Of course, saying Hoopa. Again, it was pretty obvious anyway. We're going to get Hoopa bound and everything's already in the game files. Um, what, was what else was in there? Um, the Dene Phantom. I was like, yeah, Phantom's Halloween. The Dene might be like a fairy event. Fur Fruit might be like a fashion week, whatever. Like, even like it's heart form. It's not even the game yet. I was like, yeah, easily, easily about something. So, yeah, that's pretty much everything I want to kind of cover and go over, though. Um, again, like I say, a lot of maybe Kasumi um, Pokemon may be coming to the game. Um, again, like I said, these coming, uh, this coming to the game, I would love that. And Braviary. I like Braviary, so I'm pretty cool. And Stamp I like all of them so far. Girl, probably not as much, though, but again, I mean, maybe. I don't know. Again, they're all really cool. I love Baskins. I love Zoroark. It's really good. Again, Dragon Bit possibly, possibly coming to the game. Again, like I said, Season here too is insane and December is insane. Again, like I said, this month is insane for Pokemon to play, so um, yeah. Pretty much everything I want to kind of cover and go over, though. So hopefully I break everything down, whatever, everything pretty well, though. So yeah. See you guys later, though. Thank you guys for watching. Have a great day. Great day. Have a 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 great this is a hair chasing, you know, I'll make a swan of short, probably a couple more minutes and stuff like that. So, yeah, and it's short probably for like the other uh, Pokemon's out there. So, yeah. But when it comes out, actually, but I do it when it comes out to get proper contact and stuff like that. The events, details, guides, everything, of course. So, yeah. I uh, hope I got everything good in this video. It's crazy. I talk so fast. Voice is so deep. I put it into what? See you Yeah, okay, okay, I'm done. See you guys later. We'll get out.